So guys, you probably recognize the, um, the shirt and the makeup and everything from the video I did on the uh, Child's Play movie. Um, I'm doing two videos today. I will not post them on the same day probably, but also we're going to talk about Bats and Bones monthly Ocal subscription box. You can actually elect not to get this one every single month. You can um, decide if you like it based on the theme. This was a zombie apocalypse theme that they had today or this month. It comes like this. Everything comes kind of like wrapped here. I did take one of the um, items out, the more breakable item. I will show you in a second. But first, they do have a card that comes with it. That is what it looks like this month. Then the back has all of the spoilers, so we'll that there for a second. Um, first thing I'm going to show you though is the item I took out. It is the zombie gnome. I actually have the information card for this as well where you can find the artist who made it. It has like the bloody face on the side there. It's missing an arm. His legs are like that. I assume it should go outside, but I don't know if I'm going to put it out there only because of the fact that it's kind of like hollow and like see, I don't know. I don't know if that would be okay outside or not, but anyway, there is that item, the biggest item. I like it. Here's the information that goes along with it, who made it, where to find them, things like that. Zombie gnomes. And then that there. That'll focus. It won't, but that's okay. Anyway, yeah. If you look up zombie gnomes, you'll be able to get a hold of them there. So that is the first uh, item. I'm going to look. Zombie garden gnome. Subscribers, subscribers will receive one of three. Oh, okay. Three handmade and hand-painted zombie gnome designs from Chris and Jane's place. Oh. That one is good for keeping watch over your garden. Or as a themed decor piece um, for any room in the house. Okay, yeah, mine will stay in the house. So, okay, very cool. And let's see. Ooh, this is kind of cool. They're um, well, they're men's socks, but whatever. Look at that. These are zombie foot socks, you guys. How the hell cool is that? this like this on this side here and then that there there and here's the brand there going to zombie feet socks these soft and comfy novelty socks from park parkit parkette i don't know are sure to keep your feet warm in style oh, that's cool that's really cool. Oh, I think that's a cool idea. I'm really excited about that. You know what would be really cool? If they made them toe socks, right? Like where the toes like poke through, that would have been really fun too. I would have liked that. There's that. Um, I think in a bag. Mm, okay. Oh, okay. Zombie wrap headbands. Oh, uh -huh, that's cute. Headbands. So it's like, I guess just a regular headband. It's got brains though. So it's like, oh, that's really cute. Let me see if I can get out of here. Done. Okay. Oh, I need scissors. To cut it. All right, I need scissors to cut it. Hold on. Okay, so I got scissors. I cut it. Um, oh, I think that's really cool. So that's how it goes. You know what I think I'll use this for? Probably for like when I have to wash my face at night and I don't want my hair to get wet. Um, let me see what it says. Brain twisted head wrap. Um, stretchy headband, great for holding back your hair while working out, gardening, washing your face, or applying makeup. Yeah, okay, exactly what I will use it for. <gasps> Maybe I'll use this when I do the try on portion for Ipsy. Oh, I like that. That is really cute, you guys. Look, I love it. And then we have a tea item, dried 
Zombies Brains. It's a green tea, though. It says at the bottom, green tea. There's that. Let me see. Um, Japanese sen Senka? Sencha? I don't know. Green tea blend from the UK. Brand Monster Mash Teas. Um, let out the inner zombie in you with this strong, rich, and tangy green brew. Leave to infuse for two to five minutes. Add your desired sweetener and enjoy. Okay, that's pretty neat. I'll try that later. It's kind of a small bag, but that's okay. Next we have incense. It says zombie's blood incense. I did smell it just now, and it's dragon's blood, but that's okay. Um, zombie's blood incense is a premium hand-dipped wood incense cone made with rich and bold signature scent. Um, scent flush. Eh! It's what it's what's for dinner. Uh, try some zombie blood today. So yeah, but it is again, it's dragons, like the dragon's blood for sure. And there's quite a few cones in there. I think eight of them. So there. In case you were somebody who likes to burn incense cones, they have that. Okay, this final item is the zombie plant seeds. Um, it's an annual plant. Brain pink flowers, summer bloom. Soak seeds in water for 24 hours. Press into soil with one eighth inch or two millimeter covering. Keep seed moist until germination. Okay, so here, okay, but they send it to you in this tube and that's what they look like. Okay, that's what they look like. You can plant them, it's good because it's spring. Um, and that's the last item, so I can just show this now anyway. The zombie plant seeds. Known all around the world by many names, including the sleepy plant, or touch me not. The plant reacts dramatically when touched or shaken by closing its leaves or collapsing its branches, then slowly comes back to life. Okay, that's pretty cool. Okay, well, yeah, I can plant these at some point. I just like how they come in this little tube. That's so cool. You can kind of see what they look like. There. All right, well, that's cool. That is everything in our zombie-themed Bats and Bones box for the month. Um, I will link them below. Next month's is black cat themed. You can start ordering that now. Always comes with the pretty art. The box has um, the packing peanuts. However, these particular packing peanuts, I could tell, are the ones that are biodegradable. You can actually dissolve them in water. So that is a really good thing. And the reason they had them in there this time was because of the gnome. Uh, otherwise, they don't typically just have those in there because I got the February box and that was not part of it. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed that. Have a great rest of your day, night, wherever you are. Be safe, wear a mask, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.